Uh, do you remember what we talked about the last time we were on the show? We were doing like the mu- like about music and like my favorite song and it went viral and I was super happy. This is Olivia. She's an Olivia Rodrigo super fan. What she doesn't know is that Olivia Rodrigo herself is standing right outside the room waiting to surprise her. I think a little part of me is Olivia Rodrigo, honestly. I like to sing Good For You by Olivia Rodrigo. Yeah, Olivia Rodrigo does speak to me a lot. Um, so we have a friend here. Do you mind if someone joins the interview? Someone can, it depends who. Do you mind if she joins our interview? Sure. So this is my friend, uh, Olivia Rodrigo. What? <laughs> Hi. I heard your name is Olivia too. Yeah. We're twins. <laughs> I wanted to come meet my name twin. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, what's up folks? Today we are here with Olivia Rodrigo doing a very special episode because a very special thing just happened. Oh yeah. Your um, new album. My new album, Guts, <laughs> just came out. I was like, what's the special thing? The very special thing is that she just dropped the most amazing album. We're going to be talking to kids all about the themes in it and everything with all, everything from Guts. Uh, and we'll see you there. See ya. Miles, what do you want to talk about? Most of it is love. Love. You want to describe love to us? Love it so much, we want to marry it. Honestly, I, I, I have never been in, in deep enough love where I thought I wanted to marry someone like you, so you, you must have a, a really big heart. Yeah. I really hope you'll find love. <laughs> Thanks, Miles. You are so sweet. And the only person you can't marry is your cousins. <laughs> <laughs> You're yes, so sir. right. You never miss. <laughs> what happens if you marry someone that's, that's your cousin? It may, <laughs> something bad happens to your body. Anyway, uh, Miles, what's your favorite color? Uh, blue. Thank you. Yeah. How do you think that I find love in my life? Like, yeah, see somebody that you really want to marry and you like them. Do you have any advice on like, how to search for someone that you feel that, that way about? Look at everybody around you. Okay. And then what? Pick a person that looks kind. Yeah, what are their qualities? It cannot have bags that, are, that and it's running. Out or suitcase and it's running very fast into stores and is not paying. You don't want people who have baggage or people who steal. Totally. Miles, do you know what heartbreak is? With Jack A. You're heartbroken with Jack A? I already know who I want to marry. Wait, you want to marry Jack A? But now I don't want to anymore. What? Why? Wow. Then I want to marry a new friend that never been to my school named Zoe. You want to marry Zoe? Yeah. Are you in love? Um, yeah, we actually play together. And playing together means that you're in love, right? Yeah. I agree. Have you ever felt heartbreak yourself? Oh God, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, we did talk. Oh, it's that same situation? Yeah, but have fun someday, but I'm not giving you anything. Only until uh, the rest of you, you'll be a good boy. You have chocolate all over <laughs> I am a messy oh. person. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Yeah. Do you ever listen to songs to make you feel better? I like songs. I jam. You jam? You could just sing your heart out. Do you sing your heart out? Yes, in the car. Makes you feel better. Do you think that you would ever want to be a singer? I like singing and dancing already. Yeah? Could you teach you know us? Sturdy? No, I don't know sturdy. So, uh, one way is just go like this. Okay. And then you do the same thing like this. So then you just go fast and just go like this. Wow. And then another way, which I don't think you could do. Okay. Jeez, mommy. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh my God. <laughs> you know, Miles, I, I write songs about heartbreak sometimes, about growing up, you know, different things that I, that I feel. Do, do you like listening to music? Um, I like music, but I more like dancing. You more like dancing? Could you show us some of your moves? Well, I forgot most of my moves. Okay, I understand. What's the best feeling? The best feeling is when I'm when I'm looking at a lanternfly and I want to kill it. <laughs> do your part, Miles. High five. Get rid of them. Squash them lanternflies, Olivia. Do you know about do, those? Do what Miles said. I, yeah. like I just heard about them yesterday. Yeah, I heard it's your civic duty to kill them. It's because they bark. You're the coolest, Miles. I'm so happy that I got to meet you. Thanks, Miles. Nice to meet you. You are so sweet. I guess so. Do you want to give her a hug? Okay? Yes. Oh. If my you, mom knew about this, I'm going to be yeah, really... She's known she for days. Mom! Uh, 
I told I called her last week and she's kept it a secret from you for a while. So you're a big fan? Yes, 100%. <laughs> Can I come to your concert? Of course. <laughs> wait, I have wait. a ticket with your name on it. You do? You've listened to the new album, right? Yeah, definitely. What do you think? It's one of the best albums you came out with. Wow, oh really? I gotta ask, do you still feel like a little part of you is Olivia Rodriguez? Yeah, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. It makes me feel like stronger every time I listen to it. Like women and girls can do anything that they like dream to. I feel like I can achieve more things that I would have done without listening to her song. Stop, I'm tearing up. You are the sweetest. Thank you for saying that. I'm so happy that that's how it makes you feel. She curses in her song. Do you cover your ears? No. I just say, you know what? I know I can't say that, so I won't. One, two, three. Good for you. You look happy and healthy. Not me. If you ever cared to ask. Good for you. You looking great out there without me, baby. God, I wish that I could do that. Yeah! yeah. You are an amazing singer. This a hundred times, and I wouldn't, and I would still be surprised over and over. You're one of the coolest artists I've ever seen, and you were like the first one. Like I know there were other ones, but they were like really, really childish and like kitty. But then I saw yours, and I was like, this will be the best artist in the world. And I bet when I'm older, I'll meet her. You manifested. Like if you have a dream, you should keep chasing it. It might not happen immediately, but it might happen sometime. Wow, dreams do come true. Wow. How does it make you feel that like young girls and young kids listen and like receive the positive messages in your work? Oh my gosh, I literally feel like I'm gonna get off of camera and cry because of what you just said. That is the sweetest, most powerful thing ever and I am just so happy that my music makes you feel that way. That is just everything I've ever dreamed of and more. And I'm so happy to meet you, my name twin. <laughs>